Tony Poulos here at the AI Native Telco Forum in Dusseldorf. With me, I have Francis Hasem, who is from Appledore Research. Francis, welcome. Thank you, Tony. Interesting event. What are you getting out of it so far? I'm, I'm getting a lot of it today. I think it's what, like a typical telecom TV. Actually, you just get a little bit under the skin in terms of a subject. And obviously, AI is the subject of the moment. It's the subject of the moment for our research as well. Um, and I think the, the event's been great. Um, it's great to, to see a uh, sponsor in terms of Deutsche Telekom sort of really sort of uh, really starting the show with a, a bang, really. There were some really interesting perceptive stuff by Ahmed in, in, in the show. And I have to say the morning session really concluded with possibly one of the best panel sessions I've, I've, I've heard in a long time. So I'm really real interactive at the, at the network and really sort of just digging under the subject beyond the sort of AI hype. Yeah, the, the interaction between the vendors and the operators was quite interesting today. Very open. People were very open about the issues and problems they're facing. I found the use cases the stories really brilliant. Yeah, and I, and I think also there was a, the, the practicality to it is a little bit sort of saying we're not in necessarily in a perfect condition to, to do this, but here are some practical steps that you can you you can put in put in place. Here's the challenges, and I guess the most important is actually seeing some people saying yes, this is really being done in this one. We're we're currently uh, tracking uh, a agentic AI AI generally in terms of. Of, of use cases and beyond the sort of chatbot area, we, we, until quite recently, we've seen quite a sort of low uptake of, uh, of of use cases that are going beyond the pi sort of pilot or trial station. So it's really good to hear some actual real, real, real use cases and going beyond pilot. Well, becoming an AI native telco is a lot more than the use cases. They're having to look at the network as a whole. And I think this is the first time I've been to a conference where they're really concerned about looking at all aspects of it, not just the one or two use cases. And that came out today. We're talking about even doing in-call analysis with AI and things like that. We hadn't talked about that before. No, no. And, 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 and also the, this whole idea of multi-agent, not, not sort of just simply automating what we, already, what we already do, but actually mimicking what happens in the real world today. It's, you know, telcos are full of not just cooperation, but actually conflict. Agents will have to do the same thing. How do we manage conflict? How do we manage varying intents between different parts of the organization? That's a really important um, subject to be starting. We're at an early stage. I'm not saying for one moment that we're massively multi-agentic at this stage, but people are already starting to think about, think about that problem. And I think the important thing is understanding just how widespread in the organization agentic AI decision making can be. Well, I got the feeling we're on the right track here and there's a lot more sessions coming up. So I'm going to have to let you go. And thank you that, for being with me today. That's right. And I'm thoroughly enjoying it. So uh, I'll be back next year when you, when you bring it back. Well done. Thanks, Francis.